Hello guys, this is Mike from Nitro Speed. <coughs> Hope everyone's doing well. Got a little bit of uh, fans, wagons, panels. Probably a Jeep. So, uh, anyway, we're starting off with the MBK van, which is a pretty much a, uh, uh, oh gosh, it's not really a, like a Chevy or a Dodge or a Ford, it's just a fantasy van, pretty much. I love the colors, the way it was made. Really a nice looking band. I'm glad I have it in my collection. So guys, let's go to the next one. Okay. 62 Chevy pickup. I haven't brought this one out in a long time. Pretty well slammed to the ground, that's for sure. And it's got the matte black uh, finish with the purple flames, purple and uh, pink flames on there. It's really a beautiful casting. Really like this pickup truck. Got the uh, purple rims on there. Love these 62 pickups. Real nice uh, trucks. All right, let's go to the next one. Oops. Next one. 70 Chevelle, I believe. Yeah, 70 Chevelle wagon. And this has got the Hearst Shifter logo on the side. I've had this one for quite some time. Probably about three years, two or three years. Absolutely love this wagon. Gorgeous wagon. Now, I do have a wagon coming in. It's a, uh, I think it's a Chevelle, but it's pretty cool looking casting. Uh, I still got to order it though, so I'm waiting for my uh, funds to come in from the state for medical leave. Okay, hey guys, let's go ahead and go to the next one. Okay, next one. Holland Gas. This one's a great looking uh, casting. I love it. I also have the Led Zeppelin one, just like it, with the... Uh, First album. This one's a Monarch of Oil, Lionhead, Motor Oil. And this one has got real riders on it. Real nice looking casting. I like these Holland gases. They're pretty cool looking. And, uh, yeah, I'm, di I'm really digging on this. I'm glad I got this one in my collection. I just have this one in uh, Led Zeppelin's first album. Holland gas with the uh, Hindenburg uh, blimp on there. All right, guys, next side, next one. Got some goodies coming up, guys. Some I've never brought out. And uh, one you haven't seen probably since I started collecting again four years ago. All right, let's go to the next one. A Matchbox 1970 Chevy Stepside Pickup. It's from Matchbox, and I uh, love this casting. I have two color variations of this. Let's go back a little bit here. We go right there. And uh, it's a great looking pickup truck. And uh, like I said, I've had those, uh, this one since I started collecting. Because I love the real 
like I say, I love the real cars, pickups, vans, wagons, muscle cars, classics, and so on. Don't do too many fantasy castings once in a blue moon, but I gotta really like it to wanna, you know, purchase it. And this is really a beautiful pickup truck. Absolutely a beautiful pickup truck. I love it. I love the color of it, too. And, uh, it took me a while to clean all these because some of these were so much dust in them. I had to clean them almost twice. Because of the bed of the pickup truck, it's hard to get the corners, so I have to use a paintbrush. A painter's paintbrush. To, uh, like I say, guys, this is it right here to uh, clean the bed of the trucks or hard to reach areas. All right, guys, next side, next one. All right, guys, let's go to the next one. Next one is a 40, the 40s Woody. And I uh, love this one. I've had this one for quite some time as well. Probably about two or three years. And uh, I think I have what? One, two, three. Yeah, three Woodies in my collection. And I kept this one, but I'm not real big on the graphics on the fenders and the, uh, and the hood. But I love the casting. Absolutely love the black walls on it, too. It's probably a 90s model, if I can remember correctly. Probably mid-90s. And uh, it's great casting. I absolutely love these old woodies. These are uh, my wife's very favorite type of vehicle. She loves these woodies. So I always like to get one every, so, uh, every once in a blue moon. All right, guys, next side, next one. Okay. Nineteen fifty seven Chevrolet Wagon. Yeah, this one's a gorgeous casting. Sorry, guys, I had to step away a minute. But I have this one in, what, three different paint variations? Pretty close. I have a black one, a turquoise, and this one. I love these old uh, Chevrolet wagons, just like the Nomads. But there again, another one I don't bring out hardly at all. It was very, very dusty. Very dusty. And uh, the doors do open, but there again, I'm not, I don't want to attempt to open doors or, you know, of that nature. Because a lot of times the hoods don't go all the way up and the doors kind of slant down when you open them. They don't close all the way, so. And this is an M2. Alright guys, next side, next one. Got four left. Got some real goodies to show you. Alright guys, let's go to the next one. Next one. It's on the Dodge uh, Power Wagon, I believe. Yeah, this is a Dodge Power Wagon. And, uh, I'm going to have to tilt the phone up a little bit so you can see it a little better. But I've had this one in my collection a while. It's pretty cool looking casting. I like the color. Not real, real big on the rims and tires, but that's okay. It's still a great looking casting. At least tires aren't brown. 
Yeah, this one's great. I'm glad I have a, at least one decent power wagon in my collection. The other one I have has got brown tires on it. You know, it's probably about a year old. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go to the next one. Okay, next one. Is a 56 Chevy Flash Sider. Now this one, I really like this. Burgundy and gold on it. It's pretty much a circus truck. But I would love to take this one and get it re refurbished, re, you know, done. Have just a, uh, just a solid color with no, none of the fancy graphics on it. Probably the same color. I just want to get the graphics off it. It'll look a lot better. But I do like this pickup truck. I don't bring it out a whole lot. But it is a real nice truck. Real nice looking truck. I love the body style. And as you can see, you can't see in the uh, cab of the truck because there's it's got black wall or completely sealed windows where you can't see inside. So... All right, guys, next side, next one. Got two left. All right, guys. Next one is 2020 Cheap Gladiator. I absolutely love this casting. I like the real riders on it. It's a real nice truck. A lot of real nice detail on it. It's from the Fast and Furious. And uh, pretty grateful for this one in my collection. Hold on guys, doing something for my next casting to make sure all the dust's off it. Alright guys, let's go ahead and go to the next one. And the last one for the video. Guys, if you would, smash your thumbs up, comment down below, and please subscribe guys. Next one is a 1969 Chevy Kingswood Estate. From Auto World. Now, yesterday I brought the Buick out. This today I'm bringing out the Chevy. And uh, this is a gorgeous, gorgeous uh, station wagon. Absolutely love it. I had to really clean the heck out of this one as well because it's pretty, pretty darn filthy. And uh, I do love this casting. And the realism is just, Auto World just killed it on these wagons. It just looks so good. Absolutely beautiful looking uh, casting. And, uh, grateful this one's in my collection. And this is going to be the last one for the video. Guys, smash that thumbs up, comment down below. Let me know which one was your favorite. And please subscribe, guys. Guys, have yourselves a good day, be good to each other, be well, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm on my way to watch some hockey. This is Mike from Nitro Speed. I'm out of here. See ya.